All right, I'm here in Enzo. Just went through the uh, introduction to what's gonna happen tomorrow, and the ring's gonna set up behind me. So good luck to all the fighters tomorrow, and see all you guys there. Don't forget my love. Right, Fight Nation, we are here and live. I finally finished editing this video of me fighting two years ago, and here we go. This is gonna be my live take on what happened and what my thoughts were. Hope you guys enjoy it. Each round had a lesson to it, and the first round was that everyone has a plan until they get punched in the face, and that definitely happened to me. I had the plan, and then I got punched in the face. So, Let's watch it together. Corner, wearing the black and white trunks, his official weight, 145 pounds. Please welcome Vince, Vince the, the Prince, Prince Lowe. The reason why I have a nickname was the Prince is because of the fan meet up, Dragon Ball Z. Please welcome Colin Royal. My opponent is much taller than me, and I believe actually works at a boxing gym, so the cards are stacked against me, that's for sure. A little, uh, heavier set there, eh? Well, one guy's got a decided reach advantage, but uh, Carlos is taller, but I'll tell you, Vince Lowe's a strong, strong man. Vince is a strong, strong man, yes I am. Look for Palos to use the reach. Look for, for Vince to come out and start trying to bang right away. So, one minute round. so they start gotta get to work. three rounds of one minute Especially each. In ring, I'm the blue, I'm close to the red. So I had the plan to oh, use my footwork, like I thought. dodge a oh, jab, and right smoke right there. That was what we worked on in the whole training time. You better be careful, because Palos will catch and I definitely made him angry. Run. Gotta keep that chin down. His hands up after he finishes his combination. Right. Well, they've got the right idea. Come out. My fast. opponent was definitely was more down, skilled than I was. He had uh, he's more he's traditional boxing style. Mine right. was the street fighting and style. Is the, the chin being up in the air. Yeah, whenever he fires, his chin is right there for the taking. Like, what a left hand there. Yeah. Almost caught a. Yeah. Oh, little head right here, this changed the whole fight for me because obviously it was hard to fight in front of everyone, especially in such a big stage. Uh, the headgear, there was a malfunction in the headgear, so I kind of got up over my chin and into my mouth, and uh, all I heard was, ooh, ah, uh, I thought everyone thought I got knocked out or like blacked out, so I lost composure right there. I remember that specifically. Sitting down okay. in the corner, man. Let's talk turkey here. I was fine. Bottom line. But definitely, I had to get down. Uh, trip me out. He's got to straighten his punches out. Oh, oh, God, that was, that was a time. nice shot there, but a lot of times you're taking a lot of energy throwing those. And I, I would say he's Earth. getting just a little too close to his opponent. That's he's right. Smothering himself. A bit. That's right. But the big shot for that round was that shot. I felt that one the first round. He's on my aggressiveness did. and. It was power punches that I landed. Yep. No, he has to keep the pressure on, but he's got to be a little bit more respectful of, the, of Colin's power. Because if you got your chin up and you're rushing in there, a nice, well-placed straight shot can discombobulate you very easily. I would agree with that, I'd say. 